Hello friends, I'm working in this new extension for FreeCAD. It's uh, uh, ex an external keyboard, universal keyboard for a FreeCAD for macros and any ac any FreeCAD action actually. So we can use any touch device like a, an old smartphone or a tablet just to connect to to the free cut running on the desktop and control it uh, I have this um, this is my my smartphone I project this to here in the desktop just to to record the this video but it's actually my my physical phone um, in the first screen there is a list of workbenches, installed workbenches and I can activate any of, of them physically in my in my phone for example if I want to go to the part design just click part and it's activated or I, I want to go back to part design yes part design or any other workbench for example I don't know, um, uh, arc so um uh, all this list is populated from the the actual running freecad instance we can also uh, use macros all macros are, are loaded from freecad uh, unfortunately um, most of the macros doesn't provide icons so <laughs> they all look all the same so uh, maybe i will remove the icons because they provide not nothing um, some good uh, macros provide its icons it will be it, it will it will be great if macro developers provide at least uh, an icon and a good description of the macro but um, actually there are hundreds of macros uh, in the in the in the FreeCAD repositories, but uh, many of them are have no metadata. But okay, we can use the existing here. For example, I want to um, uh, launch. For example, use this macro toggle panels visibility. So I toggle this basically in my in my external keyboard or I can for example um, launch um, uh, what this um, something that that will work is for example macro spring helix variable maybe um, yes this is a macro I never used that but okay <laughs> uh, I can launch um, uh, a grid is already there um, I can use this what this okay this change the camera position um, I can use another thing macros some some all macros doesn't render well with with style sheets. Um, um, draft three points in draft, no, nothing. Uh, box created, another old macro. Mm, alias manager, okay, it launched the alias manager for the uh, spreadsheet. And that's it. There are. Um, many things that that you can launch from here uh, the idea is also to support um, to support uh, any actions so the idea is that all these toolbar actions will be accessible from the external application um, I'm still working on this uh, because um, it's easy to do but uh, what I need to design very carefully is the user experience, the navigation itself, because the idea of this external keypad is to 
to help with usability. So um, we need to, I need to design this very carefully to, to make it very productive for the, for the user. So the idea is to, to be very productive using this, this tool because the, in FreeCAD there are hundreds of actions and macros and things like that and many of them are hidden behind menus, toolbars, etc. Blah, blah, blah. It's, it's sometimes it's very, very difficult to navigate all these things or most of the time you need to design things in multiple workbenches so you need to switch between part and part design and assembly all the time so I want to organize custom screens here so we can put my actions uh, my preferred actions or whatever or macros in in special screens so I can get uh, a lot of productivity just uh, using this external keyboard um, those screen so this is uh, the current work uh, I hope I will um, publish it soon with uh, with more features especially with uh, customizable screens and uh, uh, all these actions available from the external um, path thank you